Hi everyone. I hope everyone is doing great and is safely tucked away for the next couple of weeks. It's not going to be easy. Everybody around here is already going very stir crazy. Anyway, I have this video to just kind of let you know how I set the class up for online. I tried to keep it as close to the normal structure as possible. So if you go to your respective Blackboard courses, you'll see that there are fo a folder on the homepage for the each group of tests, all right? So in Accounting 2302, y'all will find a folder for chapters 21 and 22, which is your next exam. In Accounting 2301, you'll find a folder for chapters five and six, which is your next exam. All my classes have a test this week. So you need to go ahead and get started looking at the material. <clears throat> Within each folder, there's information for each chapter. So there are lectures, there are practice exams. There's other stuff that I can't remember at the moment, but oh well, <laughs> that's not surprising. Go and check out those folders and see what's in there. In some cases, there's PowerPoints. There might be for the first couple chapters also copies of the text in case you didn't take your books home. However, I do only have copies of you know just those few chapters that I posted. So you'll need to get a hold of your book or get a book if, if you didn't take it with you. I think a lot of the courses have online, not a lot of the courses, a lot of the book vendors, publishers have online resources available for you at the moment. So go check those out if you didn't take your book home. Okay, so like I said, everybody has a test this, this week. What I'm doing as far as tests go is in the syllabus, which was posted in, in Blackboard last week, late last week, I put down the exam dates. You will have a test at your specific class time on those dates. Exam time is the only time that you'll have something where you have to be online at a particular moment, okay? However, all the exams are not, they're not in Blackboard. They're in Blackboard, but you're just going to print it out and or work it out on paper. And then you're going to scan it or take pictures of it and upload it back into the assignment, okay? So all the tests are set up as an assignment. They'll open up at your respective class time. So for instance, if you're in Accounting 2301, you have a test on Thursday at 9.30 and the test will open up on Thursday at 9.30. If you're in Accounting 2302, then you either have a test at two o'clock on Thursday or at noon on Friday. All the tests will open up, they're all in Word. If you have a printer available, you can print them out, write your answers on the test just like you would normally and then scan it and upload it. If you don't have a printer that scans, you can take pictures of it and then upload the pictures. But please upload everything into the assignment on Blackboard, all right? Don't email me everything because I'm gonna be getting lots of emails and I don't want your tests or your homework getting mixed in with all my daily stuff. It's much easier if it's grouped together in Blackboard. Homework, will all the homework, will, you still have to do the same homework as before. All right, the homework will be handwritten. It will be due on the day of the test by midnight that night. So you don't have to turn in homework as you go along. It's just due by the night of the exam. So generally speaking, you'll have a week and a half to two weeks to get the homework done. You'll write it out on paper just like you've been doing and then either scan it or take a picture of it and upload it to the assignment. There are assignments in each of the folders, the chapter folders for the homework. What else? I think that's about it at the moment. Go in Blackboard, look around, see how it's going. I do have collaborate meetings set up for noon tomorrow, 9.30 and 2 o'clock on, on Tuesday for the respective classes where we can just do like a question and answer and see how collaborate works. You know, that's one way that y'all could, you could contact me during office hours. Obviously I'll be readily available during office hours, but hey, let's get real. I'm stuck here at home. So more than likely, I will be available all the time. I just wouldn't text me after, say, 10 o'clock at night. Ralph does go to bed kind of early, so we don't want to, you know, annoy him because everybody's already getting kind of annoyed pretty easy. Um, Ralph actually just came home from Mexico. He was on a 10-day trip to Baja. So I don't know if I will be in the building anytime soon. Since he was out of the country, it suggested that we self-quarantine for 14 days. We'll see, but you can always text me or whatnot. 
And yes, that is a giant rattlesnake on the wall behind me that was carefully shot in our yard so that we could tan the hide and hang it on the wall. Isn't that lovely? Y'all have a great day. Let me know if you have any questions and hopefully I'll see some of y'all tomorrow at noon for the accounting 20 through 2302 class that's at noon and on Tuesday in my 2301 and my 2302 that are on Tuesday. Bye.